Hello everyone, LP here back with another video and in this one I'm gonna show you how to change a gear shift knob on this W202 Mercedes C-Class and I'm also gonna make a review on this replacement shift knob from eBay and it's a commonly known pro problem for these older Mercedes cars to have a badly worn shift knobs and my car as you can see here is not an exception and the best way to fix this issue is to replace the wall shift knob which in this case as you can see here is connected to a gator cover so let's begin the procedure the first thing you'll need to do is to push this cover to a side and pull it at the same time it's best to do one side at a time like I do so one side comes out and the other side comes out as well then lift the cover all the way up and you will see this plastic tightener right here. Undo it like a regular nut and then push it down. And that's it, the old shift knob comes out. Now for the new shift knob, it's basically the reversal operation of removing the old one. What you'll need to do is to push the cover like that, then put on the new shift knob screw the tightener back on and then push back the cover into the place and that's it for installing the new shift knob now as you can see the shift knob from eBay looks a bit different to the original one as you can see the font is different and the color of the font is different as well it looks worse, there's no sport lettering and my car has a sport rim so we won't have that. You can see this line from poor manufacturing, the top material is, is rubber instead of leather. And the most important thing why this shift knob is bad is because it actually doesn't fit this Mercedes. Uh, as you can see it moves around. I had to drill the hole deeper so the shift knob could come on but now it doesn't even uh, tighten normally. It moves around, it's bad quality and I don't recommend you buying this shift knob. I leave a link down in the description and what's the most disappointing is that the most reviews of the shift knob were that it's a great replacement, it fits perfectly, it looks great, when it actually doesn't. So, that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and bye.